Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. This time I am going to be doing another unboxing because this year's version of the um, the BBM Women's Pro Wrestling cards of 2021 are out. I do believe I got some last year. Uh, I did a couple unboxing videos on that as well. This time I, I decided to get um, two boxes. And uh, let's see what we get here. We... Uh, Last time we got some pretty cool stuff. Um, I'm not nearly as versed in uh, reading katakana and stuff like that as I was last time. So it might be a little bit more tough for me to actually know what every person's name is on the card. But we, uh, we shall see. Sleeve off here. As you can see here, uh, I got I actually got a new light for my um, videos and stuff, but it, I'm having trouble finding a good balance here. So that's what it looks like. You have a Hikaru Shida up here at the top, and then a bunch of people here that um, most people should know by now. You know, like Ram, uh, Mesruga, Saki Akai, uh, Maya, Mayu, no, it's Maya Yukiki, I believe, uh, Mio, Yoshiko. Uh, Sukasa Fujimoto and all that. This will be pretty interesting because oh, they have Miu right there on the on the edge. Wow, that's a lot. So it looks like there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Does it say how many is in here? I don't know. But we got a uh, seven here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So right now, 14. If it's seven again, that'd be one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. So it looks like you get 20 packs per per thing. So let's start all the way on the right here. As you can see, the um has a Sayori Ano. I can never remember how to say her name on the packs. And on the on the sides of the box, you have um, some very interesting names. You have uh, Mei Saruga over here. But as her um, current alternate persona that she has with Saki Akai. Let me put this box over to the side here. Got my scissors here because I want to open this up as easy as possible. Now this this is this is going to be really interesting because I, uh, I I really haven't been keeping up with other Joshi promotions as much as I used to. So it'll be interesting to see all these new people. Uh, looks like we we're starting off with Maya Yukiki, which um, I'm actually very surprised to find out that she uh, that she has like multicolored eyes in this picture. She has red on the right eye and like blue on the left eye. I, I didn't know that that was a thing that she was doing. Yeah, this is this is pretty cool. I I do believe that they go and they take um. Like special pictures for each one of these cards. So it'll be interesting to see here. We got Miu or Mio. I believe her name is Mio. Uh, Mi. Yeah, Mio. Momo. Ne? Or Momo Me? Me. Momo No. I think it's Momo No. Mio Momo No. <laughs> Yeah, she's um, she's from Marvelous, and she was getting a lot of praise by people. Uh, what is it? Around um, around like the last year or so, and but I, I think she kept getting like injured, and so she's been out for quite a while. Next we have. She's not really looking familiar. Uh, says she's from Actress Girls. I'm trying to get it without the light on her. 
yeah, it's it's been a little while for me in the katakana. I'll have to brush up before the next one, <laughs> just so I uh, just so I can read these. All right, we all know her. This is Ram. She's um from the uh, the promotion like six 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 or whatever it's called. She's she's really really um become a lot more popular lately uh, with her. With her appearing in um, Ice Ribbon, I believe it is. Ice Ribbon. And uh, her name is... Remu... Kai... Oh, jeez. Yeah, I, I, I really need to brush up on my katakana. I feel a little embarrassed that I don't know any. Alright, we got the... Uh, trying to remember her name. She... Shoko? Shoko. She's from, uh, oh man, um, Tokyo Joshi Pro Wrestling. She, she was one of the few that I actually really liked from that promotion, like right after they, uh, like w when I first started watching it. Then we have Now. Now. She is from. Oh, it's not saying where she's from. Is she a freelancer? I always assumed that she wasn't a freelancer. Hmm. But yeah, we got now. It's it's interesting which of the like some of these cards they they give off a glare, but then some don't. So that's the first pack. I didn't get any special cards, unfortunately. But uh, we have many more to go. I think you only get like a couple, like like a couple per box of special cards, which makes a lot of sense. I mean, you don't want to be handing them out left and right. All right, second pack. What we got here? She looks familiar. I don't really recognize her though, uh, right off the bat. Saying her name. Oh wait, 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 no, I recognize her now. Her her picture on the on the back. It's uh. Yeah, she's in. Tokyo Joshi. And uh, looks like her name is, Mo. Ka. Her name is Mocha. Interesting. Unless I'm messing that up. Uh, Miyo Moto. Moka Miyo Moto. Yeah, I, I really liked her outfit because it was very, um, it was very like traditional looking, very interesting. Next, oh, looks like we do have a special card in here. Next, we have her. I don't recognize her at all. Uh, I couldn't even begin to guess where she's from. If I had to guess. I would say either actress girls or freelance. No, it looks like she's from Ice Ribbon. Ms. Mo. Mo something. Miyagi. Oh, Mochi. Mochi Miyagi. Oh, okay, that's her. Wow, she looks really different in this picture. Um, if you guys remember, uh, when I recently watched... I think it was the Tokyo Joshi one. I recently watched something from them, and she was there too. And she was one of the ones that I uh, I really really caught my eye because she was so skilled. She was really really good. It looks like she debuted in 2010, so she's about a 10 year vet. So that would make a lot of sense. All right, next we have Saki. She's pretty good. They have her listed as uh, Actress Girls Colors. She debuted in 2012, so about... Almost about nine years ago. Yeah, this, uh, she's she's up for debate on um, a lot of people. Like 
I know that the, there's the whole, like, the best sake kind of meme online right now. And uh, she's and she's one of them. Uh, next we have, I guess, our first special card. I, I guess they're doing, like, holographics this year. Um, because, as you can see, it, it's kind of, like, shiny. Uh, way, way more shinier than the other ones. You have, uh, like, a special back. Um, I believe this is Tai. Tai Han Hanma Tai Hanma. She's a she's a big name. She's one of the ones that um it was really hard for me to figure out who's who because uh in actress girls and all them and like across the promotions, there's like three or four different wrestlers who all looked like super identical. They just seemed like they were color swapped, kinda like in Mortal Kombat. Like it was like Tai Hanma Sayori, I know, you know, like, they, they all had this short haircut, uh, and they all had, like, a very similar looking outfit, and they were all just different colors. It was, it was pretty interesting. Next, we have someone that I don't recognize at all. This will be cool. Um, unfortunately, the name of her, of her promotion on the back is all in, um, uh, Kanji. Which I can't, I can't read. But it has her wrestling Emi Sakura. So I'm wondering if maybe she's from Gato Move. Her na name looks like it's... Sayara, Sayaka? Oh, Sayaka. Oh, is she the new Sayaka from Gato Move? Because I know that they added a Sayaka. Another Sayaka, even though they had a different Sayaka or whatever. And then the last card is, oh, a rookie. Interesting. This one has like a sp specific um, little thing right here that says rookie. I don't recognize her. Uh, looks like she's from Seedling, and that would explain why I don't recognize her. Uh, Rico? Rico Kaish. That would explain why I don't know her, because uh, Seedling is one of the harder promotions to actually watch. Uh, not a lot of their stuff gets broadcast online for me to see, so I don't really see them very often. But uh, that is one first special card, so I'm, I'm very happy about that. I'm, I'm curious if that's just how they're going to do all special cards from now on. And uh, I can already can already tell that some people are probably like cringing at how I'm handling my cards, but the I'm not I I don't get these kind of things for uh, for like resale and stuff later on. I'm they're from my own personal collection, so all right. I think this will be the last pack that I'll open here on this video, and then um, hopefully the next time I'll have a better setup so that I can have this be actually. Uh, visibly viable for you guys. So first card we have in this pack is Hikaru Shida. She should not need any kind of um, introduction at all. She's one of the more famous Joshi wrestlers in the world right now being in uh, in uh, AEW. And uh, it's funny because they have her as AEW slash Makai still, so it looks like she's still a part of Makai, or signed to it. Yeah, I'm as you guys know, I'm not like a big fan of Hikaru Shida. Um, she's good, but I don't know. I I just find her very just okay in terms of entertainment value. Next, it looks like we have a. It's not a special card, but I believe this is an announcer. Um, she's not a she's not a wrestler. And if I'm remembering correctly, it looks like Ice Ribbon and Ring. Oh, ring announcer. Yeah, Ice Ribbon. She's uh, she's the ring announcer for Ice Ribbon. Jeez. Anyway, moving on. We have uh, Miu Yamashita, I believe her name is. Miu? Miu? Yeah. She's amazing. She is one of the best wrestlers in Tokyo Joshi. Uh, a lot of people, myself included, feel like she's being wasted in Tokyo Joshi. Because... 
Uh, Tokyo Joshi Pro Wrestling is a much more character-based promotion, so their abilities in the ring isn't very, um, like, isn't very known, and not a lot of the wrestlers there are actually are, you know, that great in the ring. So, it just feels like her being so great, she's being wasted. Next, we have someone that I'm also not, uh, familiar with. She's not looking too familiar. It looks like she's from 2AW, which I have no idea what that is. So, that is a promotion that I need to look into. Uh, Rena. Looks like her name is Rena. Rena Shingaku. Interesting. She debuted in 2018, so she's been wrestling for about five years now. Uh, she's relatively tall at 161 centimeters. I don't know how much that is right off the bat. I do believe that, um, like, Momo, for example, is 155. So, let's go off of that how you will. Next is the person I'm not recognizing, again. Actress girls, okay. Looks like her name is Moi Moi Sakurai. I don't know. She's not. She's she's not ringing any bells. Oh, she debuted in twenty twenty, so she's only been wrestling for about a year at this point. That makes a lot of sense. And last but not least, we have. Aja Kong, the legend herself, the last card in this or in this video. It's so awesome. I mean, you guys know that I'm not like a huge fan of her now because I just feel like she's way too past her prime and she really just can't go like she used to. But well, she's a legend nonetheless. Like she debuted in 1986. So that's 8, 96, 2006, 2016. That's, we're at 30 years already. <laughs> then you had four more under that. So there's 34 years and 35 years she's been wrestling, it looks like. It looks like she uh, she started wrestling when she was like 16 because she's she was born in 1970. They have her at 165 centimeters, 103 kilograms. Jeez. Yeah. Yeah, that's crazy. I... I'm very happy that she was my last card that I pulled in this video. So we got three packs and one special card. So that if you if you're trying to buy some buy them yourself, um, you can use this as kind of like a ratio. I have 20 packs in this, and out of three packs already, I have had one special card. <coughs> so um, I guess. The, the real way to see this is how long until I get another special card and then you could, you could go off that like is it going to be like one every five packs one every six packs seven packs whatnot so uh, thank you for watching I hope you enjoyed I, I, I'm going to have to figure out a better setup here so you guys can just get a better view on this maybe get the light from behind instead of the front in this time so bye <laughs>